New Look 6585 is a pattern that came out in 2018 and I am going to be making view A which is this view here. It has a hood and front pockets and then this is how it looks in the back. I love the fabric that I found from Joanne Fabrics which is this 100% cotton quilted denim and it has a polyester fill in the middle. And then I will be using this fabric for the pockets, which is just a piece of scrap fabric that I had left over from a purchase that I made at LA Finch Fabrics. I have never seen a pattern like this where the hood is already attached to the pattern piece. So this is the front and the hood for piece one. It's all one long piece. And then you have piece 1A which is the bottom portion of the front and you line up the circles here to the circles here. So what I'm going to do is press out my pattern pieces, line up these circles and then tape it or pin it together and then that way I will be able to go ahead and have these as one so that I can cut out my fabric. The pattern suggests fabric such as wool, ponte or fleece. I am cutting out an extra small and I am also going to lengthen the hem. So I drew a line down, I don't know if you can see it, but I did draw a line four and a half inches down from the hem and then I'm going to cut that out to lengthen the whole garment. So I'll do the same alteration on the back piece. Starting out you are to sew 5 eighths of an inch away from this line here which is on the hood and there is a dot and when you get to the dot you sew down from the dot about an inch and you do this on both sides of the front. So you have this section here on the front and the other side also. Then you work on the pockets and let me show you. Here are the pockets and they do line up with the side seam. Next, after that, you sew the center back seam of the hood, this area here. Now my next step is to clip up to the dot on each side of the hood. So this is how the hood is looking. And then you will clip into the corner here and then clip into the corner also on this side. This pattern has a front sleeve and then it also has a back sleeve which is this piece here. And then the back is cut out on the fold and then you take the back sleeve and attach it to the back of the garment. This is the back sleeve lined up with the back. So I'm going to pin this together and stitch it and then I'll do the same thing on the other side. After the sleeve backs are sewn onto the back, then you take the sleeve front and place it on top of the back and then stitch from the shoulder down to the hem. So I will do that on both sides, of course. So I'm gonna lay this here and pin it together so that I can stitch it. I have my whole back piece together with the sleeves attached and I have the whole front together with the hood and everything. So now I am going to attach the back to the front. So you take the front of the sleeve and you attach it to this area here with this curve and then you go up to the top match the corners match the center seam same thing on this side and stitch it all together so that it will become one whole piece so now that the front and the back is combined then you just sew one long underarm seam from the hem all the way down to the bottom of the garment. So I'm gonna do that on both sides. After I tried the garment on, I was wishing that I had put a quilted pocket on the front. So I ended up adding one on top of the other pocket. And I did hem the sleeve and now I just need to finish off this front area, which includes the hood.